Hi everyone, I am SV and today I will show you how to make a very nice cartoon intro. So today I will show you how to make a very interesting cartoon effect in Cinema 4D. I will show you how to use uh, particles, how to use uh, animation of uh, MoGraph text and if you are ready, so let's start! I am in Cinema 4D and I start from Mo text. Create Mo graph text, make lens uh, hey, about 100 centimeters and use a CGO script. So end depth will be zero. I don't need any depth. First we will put Cinema 4D. For Mo graph text also rename Cinema 4D like this. Then make it somewhere bolt and middle so create a camera i will make normal camera look through the camera go to coordinates make a zero 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 like this and i don't know we will put back maybe maybe like this so text done and i'll put text somewhere here now i go to render settings I will use standard rating, not any redshift today, just standard settings. I will use a very high division. Uh, no, maybe, maybe more. Okay, I will use like this and 25 frames per second. Very nice and additional options. Uh, Anti-aliasing, I will use a best and filter animation. That's all. No any special setup for our settings. Uh, now I will prepare my display, going to options, configuration and view. Increase opacity. Okay, now you have our screen which will be rendered. Very nice. Uh, to avoid any moving of camera, we are take camera, go to cinema 4D tags and make a protection tag. Like this. That's all. Okay, first position will be here, then copy of this text, second text I will put somewhere here and rename this text for tutorial. Go to object and put here also tutorial, like this, very good, maybe somewhere here. Then copy again this text and put to the middle and write by SV or you can write everything what you like. This is, will be your intro. Like this. Okay, when it's done, when it's done, I'm going to animation. Uh, what I will do? First of all, I like to animate Cinema 4D text. I will animate it by MoGraph Effector Plane. Just standard plane. Okay, uh... In beginning, I will use how it's working. Yes, first of all, I'm going to fallout and make a line. Change maybe direction like this. And look, when I drag my line, my text going to proper position. Why is coming from up? Because on my plane, on effect, uh, on on the parameters, I have this information going to up. Okay, I will use position and I will use scale, uniform scale, minus one. Uh, why minus one? Yes, because if I go into text, to coordinates, my text is one. If I make minus one, it will be zero. I hope you are understood it. Okay, as you can see, my text going down like this. Very nice. So I going to somewhere here, take frame number 10 and make Game frame. Uh, then I'm going to two seconds more, it will be 60, and I take full this text, like this. Okay, dogs. Very good. What I have? Coming animation. Very nice. Now I will add some very interesting effect. I select Cinema 4D text, going to MoGraph, Effector, 
and add delay. Inside in the delay, I will use in a factor a spring and increase strength of the spring for 75%. And what I have now? As you can see, my texts have already very nice, very interesting animation. Like this. Very good. This is done. Uh, I can call this plane in. It means my text going in. Select text, create one more plane, and we call it out. We will do almost same settings. We are going to fall out, make a liner, change direction, and what I have. If I'm moving, my text is going somewhere out. Okay, but I like to put this text somewhere on the middle. I go into parameters and change it to the middle. Maybe to, no, 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 not behind, maybe to left, maybe like this, and reduce a scale also minus one, like this. Okay, maybe I put a little bit more. So, when this plane coming, my text going somewhere here. Very good. Uh, make animation for plane out. Go to coordinates, go to frame number 70, because I like to see my text only 10 frames. Push here, then add two seconds. I think it will be one to zero. And go here. Again, keyframe. frame. What I have now? Text coming in, text coming out. Animation done. But as you can see, when my text coming in, I have some very nice jumping effect like a spring. When my text going out, I have nothing. How to fix it? I'm going to Cinema 4D text, two letters, and delay effect I drag to the down. It means I will have in, out, and for all of them will apply delay. What I have? Check it, like this nice spring. And again, it's jumping down. Very good. Uh, select this text, select in, out, alt G on your keyboard and call it cinema. Very good. Same we will do for my tutorial. Select tutorial, going to MoGraph effector plane. First plane we are call in. Yeah, I think for this in, I have to take out this and take out this. I don't need it anymore and delay I also no need to see on my viewport. Okay, going to in, fallout, and liner. Change direction 90 degrees and check how it's working. Okay, as you can see, my text coming. Uh, I will set up this text somewhere from the center. So I pick up a little bit more and to the center, like this and make scale uniform minus one. Very good. And it will be, I will start maybe from frame number, I don't know, ni number 90, which is somewhere here. Then going to frame two seconds more, it will be here. And set up somewhere here, very good, like this. Then 10 frames I will keep like this. And I think, I think we can use same. I think I can use same plane without any problem. 200 and push back like this. Very good. Check it. Cinema coming, then it's going down and coming tutorial. But as you can see, tutorial without very nice animation. So I go to tutorial, go to letters and apply our delay downstairs. Check again what I have. I have like this, then it's going down and then going tutorial and tutorial going out. Very good. Looks like very nice. So now I make almost same animation for my last, for my last SV. Select this, this. Alt G on your keyboard, we are calling it tutorial and cinema. Uh, last one, effector, plane, plane, very good. 
I don't know. I think I will start from somewhere here. Yeah, because there is still my text. I have still my text. I'll going to Fallout to the liner. Change direction. Push somewhere here. Oh, no, 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 no. I need this. Okay. What I need? I need... It will be zero. And I think I will use only scale. Only scale for from minus one. Like this. So, uh... Yep. Coordinates here. Two seconds more. And again here. Go to SV, by SV uh, MoGraph text, and apply delay also downstairs. Okay, check all animation what I have. Cinema 4D. Then it's jumping to tutorial. Then tutorial jumping to by SV. I think very nice and very easy animation. So I take this, this, Alt G on your keyboard, we call it SV, and very nice. Okay, what I will do now? I will do some shapes animation. So going to primitives and create a torus, standard torus. For I will put a Z direction. Uh, and what I need to do? First of all, I will check final size what I need. I don't know. Maybe it will be. It will be maybe 40, and maybe only five centimeters. Yes, like this, 40 and five centimeters. Very good. So, uh, frame number zero, I will create zero and zero. I haven't nothing. Then frame number 20, I will do 40 centimeters radius and five centimeters pipe, like this. And then 10 frames more, I will reduce pipe radius up to zero. What I have, look to the center and check this animation like this very nice looks like very nice uh, then i will copy of this torus and for next torus i will full reduce i i don't know i'm going somewhere here and i full reduce a pipe segments mm, no negative not pipe segments just uh, ring segments yes just like this up to three and maybe i will increase a size up to 50 like this so Check again what I have. I have like this animation. Very good. What I will do with these toruses? Go to simulation, particles, and emitter. Change this emitter to my side and increase size like this and like this. Very good. Uh, to take a full my viewport screen what i will do now take all these two torses and put inside to emitter select emitter go to parameters particles sorry particles and enable show objects like this very good and 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 maybe i will increase 20 and 20 and what i have check it you see my emitter start working and I have very interesting animation. Very nice. Uh, what I will do now, I take my emitter. Yeah, uh, I forget to put finish burst 250. Yes, because I need it bursting all time. And you see, it's coming. It's coming. Maybe I will reduce a lifetime. I don't know. Maybe, maybe only. 100 I don't need it more again check yeah like this as you can see somewhere coming my letters and last emitters coming in this area so I take emitter and put it somewhere back maybe maybe somewhere here check again what I have okay I need to increase the size of my emitter like this and like this very nice and what I have very good shapes animation letters going out very nice looks like very interesting so how to add additional effects emitter finish what we will do now 
uh, now I create a plane Z direction make it only I don't know maybe maybe five centimeters only maybe 150 centimeters okay like this create it like this uh, going to frame number zero and make it zero zero like this very nice go to 10 frames more and make it 5 150 you have a straight line go to frame number 20 and make it I don't know somewhere here zero okay what I have I have like this very nice for what I needed take this plane create a cloner and put this plane inside to the cloner go to cloner and make a radial I don't know in present moment I cannot see because I need going to frame number 10 yeah I have like this very nice so I can increase I don't know maybe maybe 12 maybe more and increase a distance like this for what when I going to my first letter I think somewhere here frame number 30 I go to plane and take this all frames and put to the 30 now take cloner and put somewhere here for what look when my coming letter C I have like this effect you see like a straight uh, how to animate it how to make it more more interesting first of all I like to change direction maybe from this area and somewhere here like this like a like a sun maybe like a sun very good and what I will do now take a cloner go to mograph effector and step inside in the step in the parameters I need only one time offset like this 15 for what as you can see yeah look coming one and slowly one by one very interesting effects very good uh, select both of them alt G on your keyboard and we call it lines very good select lines make a copy uh, then we are going to the forward little bit and coming my tutorial so somewhere here frame number 25 so I going to line number one to the plane and drag this animation to the frame number 25 after the take cloner and put down put somewhere sorry other one somewhere here what I have yeah you see yes very nice very nice I have one more very interesting animation so check what I have coming some straights then coming somewhere here straights very good and now I hope you understood how to make this shape animation and what we will do I show you one more way how to make a shape animation uh, disk Z rotation uh, no maybe 50 no maybe 40 I reduced to 40 I now need some disk segments and put it also inside to the cloner inside to the cloner like this on the cloner I will use a I don't know maybe seven maybe seven yeah will be will be good and somewhere here no seven is too much maybe six I think it's very big size so I will reduce the size now maybe 30 okay 30 will be good then I can reduce a uh, distance and then I can increase a uh, quantity 7 okay dogs put somewhere here very nice uh, how to animate it uh, cloner is also part of MoGraph it's mean we can use all effector from the MoGraph I will use like usually plane inside in the plane I no need position I need only scale scale will be uniform 
minus one, like this. And I'll use a sphere. In where, uh, inside in the sphere, I haven't nothing, as you can see. So I will make invert. Now, everything what is inside in the sphere will have nice animation, as you can see. So I increase little bit radius, maybe, maybe 170, 170. Very good. Go somewhere here. And what I will do? Where is coming my letters? Maybe from frame number 190, I will make waypoint. And then to last frame, I will do like this. Again, waypoint. Check what I have. Cinema 4D, coming animation, going down, coming one more animation, going here, then I have like this. Looks like very nice. So I can make, select both of them, Alt J on your keyboard, put it disk like this and copy of this disk. Copy of this disk. Then what I will do, what I will do, I will change, first of all, cloner put down go somewhere here cloner down now I cannot see nothing I don't know why maybe I will put here also down okay and why I cannot see it very very strange Okay, maybe I will delete this. Oh, yeah, you see, yeah. This was too much down. Okay, I put somewhere here. Then I create a vector, plane. For the plane, I no need position. I need only scale, minus one. And I need fallout. It will be sphere inverted. Sphere inverted. Very good. Which size of my sphere here? 170. I will make also one seven zero like this and how to animate check animation of this one and zero up to 250 so i going to this plane and for frame number one seven zero i will make a keyframe and last one again keyframe and what i have Okay, looks like very nice. I no need this. I no need this. So now I create some texture. First of all, I will create a background. For for your information, this background not working for Redshift. And create a material. I no need color. I no need reflection. I need only luminance. Only luminance. And maybe maybe like this apply to background copy of this material and make it dark blue maybe maybe like this apply it to my text 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 create one more time make i don't know maybe very very violet apply to my to my line I don't know, one, two, then I'm going to emitter, create, make it very, maybe like this, I don't know, yeah, why not, why not, apply to torus number one, again, copy, make it maybe, maybe more lighter, like this, apply it to torus second one and what i have what i have i think all my parameters yeah only for disk i didn't apply for disk so create one more time going to maybe little bit green maybe like this very good and apply for disk and for disk okay uh check it somewhere here and render 
yeah looks like very nice what i don't like i don't like a uh, color of my three angels i don't like color of my three angels and very bright color of my rings so i take it take this maybe make it a little bit brighter and like this yep and i take this material also make little bit light and bright okay check what i have again render uh, yeah now it looks like more better so go somewhere forward check how it's rendered with line looks like very nice and going to check my ring somewhere here again render yeah looks like very very interesting looks like very interesting so as you can see one frame with full hd uh, rendered zero seconds very nice so we are going to parameters output save folder i don't know we will save somewhere we are creating new folder we are calling it cartoon intro intro we are going inside gives a name i don't know test like this png very good output and all frames yes don't forget to put all frames and finish just push a render and check what we have as you can see it's coming very very fast so we little bit wait i will show you all way how to make this animation so uh you can go to internet and download some cartoon sounds some cartoon sounds i'm going to after effect uh double click here and i already download some three cartoon sounds from internet this is a comedy motor from some car i don't know this is guitar slide and this is pen writing three sounds from downloaded from internet okay doc now we will wait a little bit as you can see half already done very nice jumping of my letters nice shape animation you see yes uh, start from behind and then slowly going to the forward and looks like very nice okay as you can see you can make this intro on your computer very fast it will be individual intro for you and not necessary to lose too much time for this i don't know maybe 30 40 minutes maximum and you will have nice intro which you can use to any your project any your i don't know compositions files for youtube channel yes it's not not so hard animation but looks like very very funny okay done we are going to after effect double click here go to cartoon intro take first frame and make import take this frame and put to the new composition drag and drop i have like this check it what i have looks like very nice looks like very nice but without sound okay i don't need full screen what i will do first of all take pen writing open sound effector and take this pen writing i need I don't know i i will make a copy of this counter d on your keyboard and make like like this one pen, pen writing then going here and take second one part of pen writing like this okay very good what i will do go in here and when coming my start coming my cinema i start my pen writing sound going somewhere forward when coming my tutorial i start second pen writing then again my copy and when coming my uh by sv 
helps me, I take a last one pen writing. Like this. So I increase the sound to full and you can see what I have. Ok. I already have something. For beginning it's good. Then I take a guitar slide up. What I have here. Here I have like this sound. So I take out beginning of this sound and I like to put the sound when start coming my rounds. Maybe somewhere here. Put here sound, then somewhere here. I don't know, I don't need it too much sound as you can... Oh yeah, like this. Keyframe, go to last frame and make it zero. Zero. Minus 48 is like a zero for Adobe After Effect. So, a very good. And last one, comedy motor. Just put inside. Check what the kind of this motor. Okay, we will start from beginning. Very good. And somewhere here. Game frame. I don't know, uh, maybe also I will make minus 10. Minus 10 sound. I don't need this too much. Game frame and here will be up to silent. Okay, check what I have. <laughs> yeah, it looks like very, very funny animation. You can add sound, everything what you like. Uh, but my tutorial is finished. If you like it, please subscribe, please share it to your friends. Goodbye and see you next time.